the Star Destroyer leave Jeddah and actually moves away at a leisurely pace. And I was like, how fast is this actually moving? So I did a calculation. Let's watch the video. So I tried to grab the the footage that is the best footage. Okay. And so I put a dot that's not moving in the middle of the screen. So if we what go is, back to the first clip. What does the dot do? The dot is telling me if the camera is moving. So I want to find a shot where the camera is not moving so I, I don't have to compensate for the movement. So anytime you see dots moving, this is a moving camera. So it's, I got to compensate for the camera movement. A lot of work. Don't want to that's do it. That's a lot of pain. But if the dot had instead stayed on the tower, then you're like, the camera's fixed. I can only, I right. only have to worry about the ship moving. Okay, okay. I'm exactly. with you. The next one was a little tricky because the camera stays still, but it rotates, and I didn't want to counteract the rotation. Uh, so, so the center this dot dot's still is staying on the city, yeah. but these yeah. wing dots are like moving around. Okay, I guess I'm moving see around, and I didn't want to compensate for that, so I was like, no, go for this one. Okay. And then this one was like still for a while, and then it and then it veered right. I was like, ah, I can't. Ooh, but then nice. I found a shot. This one's still. Ah, uh, so this dot is staying fairly, you know, fairly still relative to the mountains. Yeah. Okay, so your camera's like this. Fixed. Okay, okay. Exactly. So I use this tiny clip because there's movement of the starter store in the background to get the velocity measurement. So it's still camera. It's moving. Okay. So if we keep going. Cool, cool, cool. And then here you do it. Yeah. So it moves from red dot to red dot in the upper left there in 3.21 seconds. Talking about the... T okay, here it is. Yeah. This, oh, this yeah. is nicely done. The tip of the ship goes from here to here. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. That's a rough calculation. There's some jostle in the camera, it looks like. And, you know, it's hard to get with the angle of the Star Destroyer exactly how much it's moving because there's angles to deal with, which that's true. I could get more into this, but I was like, let's just do a lowest and a highest calculation to get some rough calculation. So let's see it, if we can go. It keep doesn't going. have to be perfect, but first try. Yeah. 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 So, and I, the, the, the scale to use, I think, is the length of the Star Destroyer because it's right there. Mm -hmm. And that's 1,600 meters, about a kilometer long. Okay. Yeah. yeah so yeah. I use that. Wait, I didn't 1. put 6. 0.25 in, but I don't know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> why why is it 0.25? What, what is one, this? 1.6 1. <laughs> 1. kilometers. Close enough. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Max. So there's calculation. So I said uh, the, the lowest amount that it moves is 0.25. And the highest amount that it moves is 0.5 of the length of the Star Destroyer. We'll get into it. So the speed is the distance the Star Destroyer traveled over the time it took. Mm -hmm. So if we calculate the highest speed, let's say it moves half the distance of the Star Destroyer in 3.21 so seconds. This length, it would be half the distance of the Star Destroyer. That's how you got that? Yeah. Okay. Yep. I'm with you. And so it's 0.5. The Star Destroyer length is 1,600 meters divided by 3.21 seconds. That gives 250 meters per second. Okay. About 560 miles per hour Ooh, or uh -huh. 900 I mean, okay. kilometers per hour. That's pretty fast. Fast, but my comparison is cars on the ground. So, so. <laughs> yeah, it's like, it it's like fast, jet speed there. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's the lowest totally speed, reasonable. I said, if it moved at ha a quarter of the length of the Star Destroyer. Okay. Same calculation gives us about 280 miles an hour. Okay. So then I said the speed, my speed calculation is going to be 420 miles an hour, which is the average of the two. With some error bars, 140 miles per hour, plus or minus. So, it's, so this it's is like the the expected speed, but it because of mm -hmm. the the measurements are they're, they're the hard measurements to get. Mm -hmm. Then there it could be higher or yeah. lower by 140 miles per hour. Okay, yeah. yeah. Now, now I can definitely improve on that because I know what a star destroyer is, and I could rotate it and look at the image and match the rotation angle, and then yeah. I feel like I could get a vector and assume mm -hmm. it's moving mm -hmm. forward. And I could also compensate for a little bit of scoop up. Oh, yeah, so there's true. a lot of things I could reduce to get that redu reduced quite a bit, but I didn't want to do it. Plus so let's say, yeah, 420 miles an hour, which mm -hmm. is like jet speed, like human on earth jet speed, like a little bit slower maybe. Mm -hmm. So it's actually moving decently fast, but it's it's capable of like faster than light speed. So my guess is it's not using the big blue engines. It's like moving off at a slow speed so as not to damage the city with the mm -hmm, big blue mm -hmm. engines. And then when it gets far enough away, then it'll go. That's that's my guess. Yeah. Because so there's like I guess same thing in Star Trek to make a <laughs> to make a map here. You get your impulse speed for when you're nearby mm -hmm. inside the atmospheres and then once you're outside the planet, then you do your jump. Right. So actually courteous by the empire, they're not right, just right, blowing yeah. the city away. Right. Thank you. Thank you mm -hmm. empire. Yeah. And I think the speed makes sense. Jets about speed of a jetliner. Seems seems reasonable. Yeah, because at some point you're limited by the atmosphere. 
Like you can't right. you can't just go faster indefinitely. And there's right. no reason so there's, to break the Mach speed for the Star Destroyer that's just slowly leaving the planet. Fine. Right. So it's got some air drag, but there's no like heating or sound yeah. barrier complications. Yeah. Good speed. It's good speed. So that the, good like job. A, a no rush. Yeah. Good job. So realistic speed. I like it. Good job, CG department. Oh, that's a good point. Yep. Mm-hmm.